similar crime that happened here in Colombia uh, last June. Police are not saying whether or not they're connected, but they are looking into that possibility. This particular crime took place at 545 yesterday in broad daylight and is now a huge pain for car owners. It's a shame. It's, I mean, I've lived here for eight years and never seen anything like it. Sue Warren's car got hit along with 20 others on Softwater Way in Columbia. They kind of came by and, you know, there was a big splash, you know, of, of this gold paint across here, which I got off already. And then they'd come here and they put a little bit there. And then one of the cars that actually had a, uh, you know, you know, these are straight up and down, so they couldn't write much. But on the, on the trunks where they could, you know, they sprawled in obscenity and... Um, did what they could, but most of them, most of us just got slashes. The vandals also spray painted a sign and an electric box. Some neighbor was smart enough. He saw them uh, writing on the utility box and on the the entrance sign, mm -hmm. and he called and he called the police. Police caught the two vandals as they were attempting to flee. The two arrested are Maurice Lamont Whitaker. Uh, he's 18 of Wood Park Lane in Columbia. And also arrested was a 13 year old juvenile male, also of Columbia. Now, police say they do not believe that these crimes are gang related or hate crime related. Reporting live in Ellicott City, Lisa Robinson, WBAL TV 11 News. Lisa, thanks.